Yo, hey man, what's good with y'all boys? We back out here on this NBA 2K25. And as y'all boys can see by the title, man, I got y'all boys with the best center builds in NBA 2K24. Now look, y'all, I got these builds. They kind of influenced by some other influencers and some other content creators, man. But I just tweaked a little bit of things and I changed around to fit my play style. So if y'all boys want to use these builds, man, you know what I'm saying? Why not just go ahead and use it right now? Because I'm going to tell you, bro, these hoes is going to have you cooking, shaking, and baking, post scoring, whatever the fuck you want to do. The first build that I'm going to make is kind of like similar to Wimby Yama, man. So I know y'all boys going to be jacking it. But I'm saying if you're not jacking it, bro, don't use the build. If you're jacking it, use the build. Let me know down below in the comments, bro. If you use the building, you make the building you like it. Let me know down below in the comments, man. But I'm not gonna do too much talking. Let's get straight into it. Now, y'all, boys, see, we are in the builder, man. You wanna go to create your own build. You don't wanna go to no Pro Tune build. You don't wanna go to the NBA build. You wanna go to creating your own build, man. So, y'all, boys, see, man, the first name, I'm going with MJ. The last name, I'm going with Uzi. I don't know why, but I'm going with Uzi. I guess some shit that changed, so I wanna change my shit to Uzi now. Now, y'all know me, I'm going left handed. You can go left hand, right hand, don't matter. Whichever play style fits you, man. Cause that's all you want to do is put make your build to fit your play style. That's what you want to do. You don't want to get to fit no other consecrator. Fit your play style, my dog. Then you already know, man. The jersey number is number one, man. Sometimes I go number seven. It depends on how I'm feeling. I like one and seven. They're my favorite numbers. Now for the first build, you do want to go to position of a center, my dog. You want to go with a center, bro. I'm gonna give y'all a power forward build and I'm gonna give y'all a center build. So y'all boys stay in tune, man. Then with the height, bro, you want to go with seven foot. I think that might be max height. Nope, it's seven foot. So you want to go with seven foot as a height. Then with your weight, you want to go two fifty three. You want to get a little bit of strength, so you got 99 strength down there. And then you want to go to wingspan of a 7-4. Now, here we go, man. Getting straight into the attributes. We're going to start off. You're going to put your close shot on a 77, bro. You want that 77, my dog. You feel what I'm saying? So you can get them drop steps. Whatever you're trying to do, get the, all the close shots. Because, listen, bro, I'm going to be real. Drive and layup and close shot matter this year. It didn't matter in the past 2Ks, but this year it mattered. I done played against people with 99 driving layups. And I'm telling you, your driving layup and your strength, them two things is critical as fuck. You're going to need them because you want to you want to you want to make all them layups bro you want to be able to get what is it called a bruiser you want to move people out the way lay that bitch up whatever you want to do but you're going to need that shit man so you want to put your close shot at least 70 or plus you feel what i'm saying so yeah now from the driving layup i am on a big so i'm really not going to be getting that many driving layups as you guys know man so look driving layup we went 69 bro you feel what i'm saying or you maybe could bump it up and go probably like 83 you know what i'm saying 83 but it's going to put your close shot up to a 78 so yeah you don't want that to happen and then you want to go to your driving dunk and you could probably put a little bit more up on this and you boom you got a 78 driving dunk you, if you really do the math bro you're a center you're really not going to be driving dunking honestly like that you probably gonna have a guard to dish it down to you or if you plan the ones you might get a couple driving dunks but i'm gonna be real 78 is pretty sturdy for a big man now for your standing dunk man you do want gold rise up bro y'all see the the requirements that you need to hall of fame but you're not gonna have that requirement bro so you're gonna be able to get it on gold so standing dunk you want to put that mug on a 90 bro now with your post control you do want to go 60 because you are seven foot so you really don't need that much post control now this build will be able to shoot man so don't think your build is not gonna be able to shoot because i'm telling y'all i'm telling y'all it is so easy to shoot on NBA 2K25. It's so easy to hit your shots and do whatever you got to do to score using that jump shot. You feel what I'm saying? So you want to put your mid-range on an 80. You know what I'm saying? You see the best y'all get. Y'all get dead on bronze, post fade for nom on bronze, set shot specialist on gold, I mean, uh, silver, things of that nature, man. Then you want to go down. Then you want to go down, man, to your three ball. You see it's on 75, your free throw 76. You can up that, tweak it a little more to your play style. If you play rec, my career Turn your free throw up, bro, literally, but I'm going with a 76 because I don't really play too much of the modes. Now, for your pass accuracy, you do want to go with a 78 pass accuracy, man. Feel what I'm saying? The pass accuracy, you just don't want to have to pass the ball and that shit go all out of bounds, bro. Like, you feel what I'm saying? So, put that pass accuracy up, man. You might be passing the ball. Now, y'all already know ball handling shit matter. We skip it over. That speed with ball doesn't matter. You're not going to be able to get no crazy dribble moves, man, so there's no point. Now, with your interior defense, you do want to put this mug on a 77. Put your interior defense on a 77, but to help make up for it, you are seven foot. Unlike some people they go 6'9 on their center build so, but look bro you're 7 foot so there's no way you mean to tell me and you got a 7'4 wingspan that you can't get good interior defense man you know what I'm saying and then you got 87 strength on top of that that's all you need to be successful in NBA 2K25 now with your steal you want to put that on 60 self explanatory you're not going to really be too much reaching unless you that type of center I don't really too much reach if I'm on my center build I literally just camp out in the paint play defense interior defense and then you know what I'm saying if I have to guard a guard or two you know what I'm saying maybe I'll step up but yeah man that's pretty much the case for that now with your block you do want to go to a 92 block 
spot, man. Y'all see that pogo stick on gold? Feel what I'm saying? Pogo stick on gold. I don't know. Some about that that fucking build. That shit sounds sus as fuck. But um, yeah, man, we got that on gold. Y'all boys see the offensive rebound 93. Then we got defensive rebound 90. Got gold box out beast gold pogo stick gold rebound chaser things of that nature. Y'all see we got a 60 speed, 48 agility, 87 strength, 77 vertical. Y'all see what we got, man. Y'all see the badges. Y'all see everything. See the takeovers we get. What I'm saying. And then look, I'm just basically go over. This, let y'all boys see all the badges, man. Y'all see all the badges on the side, bro. You feel what I'm saying? They nice. It's a nice build. I, I kind of broke up there. This is a nice build. You know what I'm saying? I'm a little sick, y'all. So y'all boys bear with me, man. We got Jack Sigma, Jawusa Nuggets. I don't know who the fuck these people are, but um, this is the build, man. This is the build. The inside the art Mysterio. That is build number one. I'm gonna give y'all boys three builds. So y'all boys stay tuned. Hit that like button. Hit that sub button. Let's get to the next build. All right, y'all boys, man. Look, that's gonna wrap up the video for today, man. If y'all boys enjoyed this video, man, make sure y'all smash that like button. Look, I know this video was a real short video, bro. But look, I'm telling y'all, it's probably gonna be the shortest video of the year. It's five minutes long, but I'm telling you, the rest of the next of the videos are gonna be like at least 10, 20 minutes plus. Also, make sure y'all click on the video on the stream, man. It was a straight banger. And I'll see y'all boys in the next video, man. We out. Hey.